These foes I place before you, these rules, I do not know truly if they will train you for the challenges that Callus will place in your way. Of course, we know how this part of the story ends. The Emperor is merely the face on the throne. Behind him, the usurper pulls the strings. The one who sits upon the throne of life and death has a great influence upon the world. Their very soul permeates the lands and fills the hearts of the people. Keen Eye will notice that themes repeat themselves. Events too. The wheel ever turns. I never understood the duel. If you are at war, Use every tool at your disposal. If not, let things lie. peace on your travels. Savor it. They have naught but contempt for you. I cannot understand why you would have anything to do with them.
Here's a token for you, if you can earn it. Ancient smiths have considered the same issues we do, how to handle hunger and resources during battle. Fire is a symbol of so much purity, will, creative force and power, a moment of inattention and it becomes pure destruction. That should help. I am not a vain man. You must appreciate that the game, this game, has been my focus for more years than I can count. I have a certain pride regarding its twists and turns. Yet inattention leads to disaster. Not every inch of the wilderness is peaceful. One more relic is within your grasp. Who hired these thieves? That is the true question. Ah! <laughs> 
those who are desperate can never hope to get the best possible price. to find more food. Starving now. Every fresh encounter will cause you damage. Tread carefully. So hunger gnaws at us once more and leaves us dead and unfulfilled. Not this time. <laughs> <laughs> 